Hello everyone, welcome to Milky Singh Academy. This is Jaskira Singh here. Today in this video, I'm going to show you that how you can sign up for Microsoft 365 E3 business account. And I'm going to cover everything here, what kind of things you're going to need for that. And uh, later in this video, I'm going to also show you that how you can get a trial version of the same Microsoft E3 account. And I'm going to cover everything here, business uh, accounts like various subscriptions and all that. And if you are new here to my account, do subscribe to my channel. I keep posting these kind of videos related to computer science and uh, Microsoft 365 products. So you can go ahead and uh, go through all my playlists and videos. So that will be really helpful for you. So without wasting any time, let's get started to this thing. So guys, first of all, in the search window, type uh, Microsoft Office 365 all products. So it's gonna open up this uh, Microsoft official website. So you have to click on the second link. So it is saying that compare all products of Microsoft 365 plans. So when you click on this uh, link here, it will open up the official website. So currently it is uh, the home tab that is selected here. So for home that you want to Microsoft 365 family products. So there are various products for office of oh, sorry for home also so these are the various uh, fees and uh, subscriptions for business we have to switch to the for business tab so you can see here different products for business accounts like 365 basic business business standard business premium and uh, 365 apps so if you go through all these products so you can um, figure out which kind of product is best for you so these are products basically categorized by different categories of applications so you can figure out by going to further details about these products so in this video i'm going to show you that how you can uh, set up a account for microsoft 365 e3 business account so for that you have to open up this link and uh, you have to click on this buy now option so this is the button where you have to sign up for this uh, e3 account so when you click on that buy now button so it will open up this uh, Microsoft 365 business standard uh, sign up window here. So here you have to fill out all the details like uh, Which country are you from? So I'm from India. So I'm going to select that and first name So first name that must be your admin name. So you have to type in that name So my name so that is my father's name Alki Singh Academy So business email ID that your business of your company's email ID and your business phone number so you have to write your business phone number here so you have to provide all the details so business phone number that belongs to your company and after that company name so i'm uh, write a abbreviation for that so msa so mckeesing academy so after that we have to select the organization size so i'm selecting this 1000 plus people so after that click on next button so it will take you to the next window here so when you click on the next window it will asking you to it will ask sorry it asks you to create a new id so username so you can select a username so i'm selecting msa and your company so make sure that be very careful while writing this uh, user id so i'm writing your company name is chd india so that will be your tenant name chd india so whatever you are writing here because uh, later on you need gonna need that tenant name while you're assigning different licenses to different users so that is my id here you can see msa at durate chd india dot on microsoft.com so after that we have to prior type in the password here and guys you can later on change the domain name so it is saying on microsoft.com you can change it to your school uh, your organization website so after checking all the checkboxes click on create account and when you do that it will ask your mobile number again that uh, you are not a robot so type in your mobile number again and make sure you are selecting the country code so india has a plus nine one country code i'm writing my code here and they're gonna microsoft going to send a text message to your mobile number so a verification code so you have to enter the verification code here so mine is four eight and let me see nine three one zero after writing the verification code click on next button and it will take you to another window where you have to pay for these uh, subscriptions so i'm creating a microsoft premium e3 account so i'm going to pay for that and it is going to open up uh, this window here where you have to type in your company address name city pin code and uh, state or province and your gs tin so that is my uh, company's uh, uh, tax number pan number so i am in from india so there are 
just and pan number so i'm going to fill out all the details here of my company here similarly you have to say do the same thing so type in all the details so after typing all the details you have to click on next and here you can see so it is asking the calculating all the details here so if i select two users so that is three one hundred one thousand to three hundred to two uh, three hundred twenty rupees so that is approximately ten dollars so depending upon your country it will calculate the that currency code so after that click on next button here and it will calculate all that and here you have to pay for that so it, it is going to you can select pay by the year or pay by the month so you have to click on and it will open up this window here now it is pretty simple here all you have to do is to select your credit card and uh, you have to type in the card number and your name address and all that so it's pretty simple all you have to do so i'm going to cancel it and if i click on cancel and click on my cancel my order it is uh, do create your admin panel but uh, you have haven't subscribed to any subscription so it will not going to add into your admin center so it is going to create a admin center for that and i'm going to show you that how you can get a trial version for that so i'm that is why i cancelled order so here you can see guys that this is your microsoft 365 admin center so your admin center is all same for the different products of microsoft so you can add a user here so just click on add a user and fill out the all the details and if you want to add a multiple users and guys you can uh, go ahead and check out all the playlist i have created all the steps here in different videos so you can go through all that so you can manage your admin center pretty easy so all uh, all is done here so for getting a trial version you have to come here to the billing section you can see so if i click on this licenses here so as uh, i haven't paid anything to microsoft so that is why it is not going to show anything here so you can see we didn't find anything matches here because i haven't subscribed to any channel and if i go to my products here and see again uh, i'm not going to see any products here so that is why i'm going to go to this purchase services so you have to go here to this purchase services here and it will open up the services that you can attain by subscribing to them so it will open up that window here so clearly you can see uh, it will open up here so you can see so microsoft 365 business premium month to month and business premium business standard and all these are products of various products of business services so varying from user and subscription fees so you have to figure out first that which kind of uh, microsoft 365 e or e1 f1 so which product as you actually like to buy so here i'm going to create a trial version for microsoft 365 e3 so you have to click on the details of that and you can also compare all the products with one another so click on this details button and it will open up this uh, microsoft 365 e3 panel here and again you can see all the details about that and uh, so for that getting a trial version click on this get trial tri uh, so get free trial so click on that and uh, it will open a new window where again you have to prove that uh, you are not a robot so i'm selecting my india course so that is plus nine one so depending on your country code so you have to select from this drop down list here so india 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 where it is so i and i really also here it is india and uh, you have to type in your uh, mobile number again so your business mobile number and click on text me so microsoft is again going to send you a verification code here so let me so let me check my mobile here and uh, so here it is a uh, this verification code is 53176 so click on start for your free trial and it will it will create a free account so if it happens like something like this just click on try again and uh, it will create your account so here just uh, click on try now and uh, it will create your account with 25 users so microsoft is going to give you a 25 users for a trial version for one month click on continue and uh, your order will be placed here and uh, just uh, wait for a few seconds so it will uh, gonna show you in your admin center so here guys you can see user management so we have uh, assigned 25 users total balance is zero so that is your billing section here now let me add a one user here so i'm going to uh, click on add a user so you can add a user here so when i click on add a user it will open up this window here where you can add users so set up the basics so this is you can also 
uh, upload multiple users so you can watch my video on that so go through my channel and uh, you can uh, get this video in this uh, Microsoft uh, how to sign up for a one in that video and so let me create a password so you can create a password and click on next button so that is going to add a uh, product license so here you can see guys we have uh, total 25 uh, licenses uh, for e3 so that is 24 if we use this license and click on next button so it is going to assign this uh, microsoft e3 uh, license to this particular user to me for example so you can add these and this is pretty simple you can easily uh, add a user here so after adding the user so it will add here and it will automatically assign the e3 and you can also buy multiple licenses for different users and uh, so you can see uh, we have uh, added a just key thing into this company and click on submit so you can see a user has been added here microsoft e365 e3 license has been assigned and uh, you can again go to your products and if you want to extend your licenses and you want uh, you really happy with the microsoft e3 product so you can subscribe to more users so you have you can see uh, 23 users are here and uh, this product is expire is going to expire on 30th of october and you can also extend the trial here just click on this extend trial option here <coughs> and type in all the credit card details so they are going to extend your trial version for 30 days so this is how you can figure out how you extend your trial version and all that so <coughs> i'm not going to cover here how you can extend your trial so it is pretty simple all you have to do is you provide your credit card details so you're gonna get <coughs> one month extension for that so that is all guys how you can sign up for microsoft 365 e3 account and at last if you like this video do subscribe to my channel and hit the like button and see you soon guys